Yo, YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Jay Farmers, and look, I'm back with another video. And this one, this one is a very interesting topic. Uh, today, I'm going to be talking about medical leeches and the importance of medical leeches and what they do in healthcare and how do we utilize them in a pharmacy. Um, what you guys don't know is medical leeches are designed to suck you dry. You know, like that one X back in high school. <laughs> Can I, can I, <laughs> can I say that on YouTube? I don't know, kids watching? I don't know, hey, hey, no. Yes, medical leeches are designed to suck you dry, in a sense, so get your mind out the gutter. Get your mind out the gutter. But, yes, for those of you who wasn't aware, we do have medical leeches um, in the healthcare period. Uh, surgeons use them all the time in surgery um, in order to reattach limbs, fingers, um, in order to coagulate the blood so the blood can run smoother so old blood can form and flow well with the new blood that comes in. It's all, it all sounds crazy, but trust me, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna educate you guys on medical leeches, on how they look, what they do, um, and everything of that sort. When people think of leeches, you know, they think of big, big slimy worm things, which, which you should, that's what they are. Um, big slimy worm thing that attached to your body and suck all the blood out of you like a vampire, which is true. But in medical terms, some leeches are are parasites, but some other leeches are, you know, they help you in the medical field. And the ones that are used in the medical field are very tiny before they start sucking on your blood. Um, they can suck. <laughs> Woo! Memories. Okay. So they can suck almost five times their own body weight as far as blood is concerned. They will start out this small, and when they get done, they will be like gigantic. Um, the whole time you will be, if you if you ever had a medical leech ordered or you want to take leech therapy, you will be wide awake the entire time. Like you won't be under no and no type of anesthetic, no type of numbing pain medicine, like nothing. You will be walked the entire time. Um, although I don't know because I haven't got bit by a medical leech personally to give you guys the experience and the knowledge, but I've seen it and I handle leeches on a daily in my job. Um, so yeah, I'm dedicated. I just got out work and I still got out my scrubs and stuff, y'all. So, and I just wanted to make this video about medical leeches. Cause every time I post medical leeches on my Insta story or my Facebook story, people seem to be um, bamboozled there. Oh God, leeches, like bugs, slimy leeches are used in medicine, how? Okay, da 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 da, so we'll just sit tight. <laughs> so yeah, the good old medical leeches. So what they do is, medical leeches, um, they have three jaws at the point of contact or at the point of entry, okay? And what they do is, as soon as you put them on the flesh, they will find um, whatever spot they feel comfortable in and they would just dig in bro. They would just get right up in there And today they're mostly used in plastic surgery and or microsurgery um, This is simply because leeches secrete some type of peptide and proteins um, That work to prevent blood clots and these secretors um, are also known as anticoagulants leeches hold the most potent anticoagulant in the world like known to man you have some drugs like warfarin and other drugs that are act as anticoagulants to uh to thin the blood or they call them blood thinners um typically what we call them in the medical field blood thinners um but leeches they definitely have the most potent anticoagulant um known to man so leeches have like a lot of uses in the medical field, some of which um, people who undergo some type of heart disease or some type of, you know, health problem. And some people benefit from leeches where they may be at risk of getting their limb amputated, like I said earlier, um, getting their finger amputated or getting some type of their body amputated. Leeches can help with that. So yeah, the scientific name for a leech, um, if you took any type of biology class, in college, um, you will know that everything is in a specific phylum. Everything is in a specific genus, species, phylum, class, rank, order, all this stuff. So leeches is no different. Um, they're, they are in the animal kingdom. They are in the species. They are the scientific name for medical leeches are Hirudo medicinalis. 
And we have to clean our leeches, yes. We have to clean our leeches in the sense um, every two days or so often. Because once we order the leech, yes, we have to order leeches. Once we order leeches, um, they come in like at least 50, 60, maybe 70 a pack. Um, and we have to put them in water immediately. And then we have to put them in cold water. Um, so once we do that, we have to change them every two days so they can stay alive. And then we have to feed them some type of salt, um, some type of leech salt or whatever you want to call it in the water so we get them two pints of not two pints we give them two liters of sterile water um and then one small pint of leech salt whatever you want to call this it, leech salt so i mean they just sit there and, and not move and just wait on the action so they just wait and wait and wait to be seen wait to be called upon wait to be picked up uh, they just be bored at the bottom of the barrel. <laughs> Leeches are very harmless. They just want to suck. That's it. <laughs> they just want to suck. That's it. They just want to suck. And then when they're done, they leave. <laughs> That's it. I'm sorry. What I'm about to show you is very, very graphical. So I hope you guys are ready for it. So you Google search medical leeches and surgery. And then you click on images. And you see some of these images um, of what the leech job is and how they do specifically with limbs you see this this is exactly what leeches do although it might look painful it's definitely not painful um probably painful in the sense that her feet was already like this but not painful in the sense that the leech is doing its job um as you can see like things like this it's, it's very graphical um but leeches are definitely designed to help you in situations like this. Um, whatever tragic events that, you know, has happened to these people, they need the leeches in order to save dead tissue and to coagulate new blood throughout. So, some of this stuff, although it might look painful, I can guarantee you that doctors use leeches um, probably more often than not, I'm telling you. You see how the leech attaches on to the site and it's getting bigger and bigger. I guarantee you those leeches was very, very small before um, it attached on. But once it attaches on, you see this dead tissue right here and all this other dead tissue the, where, where the black is. Um, leeches, they, they have the most potent anticoagulant, which their saliva, once bitten, um, can go inside the blood and coagulate. So new blood can flow from the leeches so it can... It, it, it prevents blood clotting, you know, so the blood can flow throughout the rest of the body. So the rest of the body can, you know, join together with the new, the new flow of the blood with the leeches. So this tissue can heal itself. Um, so it won't be just dead tissue because if this is just dead tissue, then it mean the rest of the foot is dead because it's not getting, you know, proper blood flow to the rest of the extremities, the limbs and stuff like that. So, yeah. Once they attach by, you know, the mouth, they cut through the membrane. Leeches are designed to, you know, suck in a rhythmic movement called peristalsis. And they have one large digestive tract, uh, which is right here in red, uh, can expand to hold huge, huge quantities of blood. And this prevents them from, I guess, in a sense, exploding or um, damaging some, some some internal organs in the inside of leeches. As I mentioned earlier, it has some specialized saliva that helps keep flowing the blood properly so that tissue can definitely live on. So leeches are very, very important. And I mean, that's about it. Like I got, I showed you guys leeches. I showed you guys the importance of leeches, how they look, the anatomy of it. Um, so I just wanted to give this informational video out to people who who didn't know leeches existed in the medical field because they most certainly do. It is one of the most used natural remedies um, in medicine when people need leech therapy, when drugs just not getting the job done. So people turn to leeches and I just want to make it to where if you guys feel like you learned something new today in this video, like just, just give it a thumbs up. I'm always glad to, you know, give people perspective on, you know, pharmacy in general and just medicine in general where people don't really just 
see from the outside looking in. Oh yeah, there you have it. Go tell your kid, go tell your grandmama, go tell your sister, brother, auntie, what you've learned today about leeches. They not all bad, they actually help you. So, <laughs> holla your boy.